Howdy y'all, welcome back. In my research, I often come across interesting and anomalous photographs, artistic depictions, and on the rare occasion, even maps that will leave us questioning the nature of the historical narrative at hand. Today, I'd like to share with you two unique maps, which I have never seen shared anywhere else before. What makes these maps, which are of America, so interesting is the fact that they were published under the auspices of presenting the American people with a possibility of what was to come. I like to call these predictive maps, and as we zoom in and dive into the details of each, you will come to see exactly why. The first map was seen in Life magazine on February 10th, 1916, and is entitled My Country Tis of Thee. This map is astounding. It presents the American landscape under new leadership with nearly every major city being renamed. This map was created during the time directly before the United States would join the war effort against Germany. The second map, which led to the title of this video, comes to us from the Los Angeles Examiner known as a newspaper for people who think, first seen on Sunday, November 14th, 1937. This map is titled if we enter a world war and lose, and again, depicts the United States under a new regime or set of regimes. In this simulation, if you want to call it that, the US has been divided up and handed to the victors. What stands out, and what you'll see when we zoom in on the details of this map, is just how flabbergasting the idea is that this map was published to a majority of Hollywood and greater Los Angeles, and subsequently to greater parts of America. The map, dated to 1937, predates the outbreak of the Second World War by nearly two years, so to imagine this sort of predictive and seemingly definitive in nature map being showcased at all is quite interesting. So let us now really zoom in on the details of these two maps, beginning with the map from 1917. I'm going to chime out with the narrative while we get a closer look, and I'd love to hear your thoughts about what we're seeing in the comment section down below. 